All right, everyone, so the patch notes for update 42 are out. And as usual, let's go through the bigger changes in this update, starting with two new maps, one intermediate and one advanced one, and they are both amazing. The first one is called Aztec Assault. This is an amazing looking map as usual with the blues coming out of the right and the left sides. And now some of them go inside the temple, but some of them continue walking down the path and you cannot have any towers on top of the temple. You can only have them at the bottom. Now, the second one is the first ever official 3D map in Blues TD6 called Sleuth Lurpa and this one just again in usual Ninja Kiwi fashion looks absolutely amazing. Uh, it's only a single track the balloons are coming out from the top and they're walking out at the bottom so it shouldn't be too difficult and then if you want to you can have monkeys onto these hedges but this is just an amazing looking map. Now there are three new quests including a brand new tutorial quest which as usual we're not allowed to show them to you guys but I thought I should just mention them and then a huge change that's going to make half cash mode actually a lot more difficult is that double cash mode no longer works in half cash. So let me show you guys, I'm just going to enable double cash mode and let's just pull up an actual game so that you guys can see. Uh, let's just go first on easy standard, something like that, so that you guys can see the uh, basically the symbol, the X2 symbol which appears, which is an indicator that double cash mode is active. But if we go on to half cash mode, if we just pull up, I'm going to do the same thing, by the way, just go like monkey metal on half cash mode. And what you guys are going to see is that this thing does not actually work and it's only the $425. So half cash, even though double cash mode is enabled, it just doesn't work on half cash like it does in shift mode but powers and insta monkeys are still usable so i guess it's not that bad we also have three new monkey knowledge points aimed at the bomb sure and i think this is because of the recent nerf that happened in update 40 of it not being able to pop black balloons once you get to the frag bombs so the first one is called more frags let me just send in a couple of balloons by the way so i can show you guys the first one is called more frags and it basically gives the bomb sure two extra frags uh, the second one is called frag gear which increases the pierce of the frags and then the last one is called fragalicious which increases is the damage of the frag bombs by one. Now moving on to the balance changes, the Melopad Dark Monkey actually gets extra attack speed for every upgrade starting from tier three. So tier three gets 15%, uh, 25% for tier four, and then 50% for tier five. And I think that this was actually aimed so that the uh, because the attack speed carries over uh, to the uh, to the ability, I think that th this was just meant to make the ability a little bit stronger. And it's actually more viable as a standalone tower. Now onto the sub paragon, this one was, as you guys remember, a little bit under when it launched so now uh, the projectiles that it, it throws out are a little bit faster uh, it no longer decreases the attack speed of nearby well actually I have Benji so I can't show you guys but it no longer decreases the attack speed of nearby heroes which is amazing but not that impactful and now the submerged damage got increased by four times so now this means that you know it used to be a little bit underwhelming so I'm just gonna send in like round 150 uh, just 45 ceramics here you guys are gonna see that this thing is just going to eat them up so a lot more viable than it used to be and then most Importantly, the cooldown of the ability got reduced by 60%. So uh, there's not going to be that much wait time in between abilities, which is really nice, actually. Now, the heli also got changed. Uh, and it actually, the base tower gets 5% extra movement speed and also 3% extra movement speed on the Apache Dart Chip and 2% extra movement speed on the Apache Prime, which is basically reverting a nerf that happened a lot of updates ago. This was a very long time ago, which made the tower slower. So now they're kind of reverting it back. And this also indirectly makes the bottom path a lot stronger because the bigger jets upgrade uh, gives extra extra movement speed and now it's no longer going to be necessary. The Blue Master Alchemist now finally gives cash for popping all transformed balloons. So previously it would just transform a blimp into a red balloon and not give any cash. But now let me just actually switch the cash to uh, to like zero dollars so that you guys can see. So as soon as the golden potion gets thrown onto the ZOMG, boom, there we go. We get some cash back, which is a really nice change. And this should make it a lot more viable in chimps mode now. Now this is a change that's really important. The Druid Storms now do plus 10 damage and this is so the we cannot regrow farm and just stall rounds in general so if i send in a regrow balloon you guys are gonna see that this thing is just gonna pop and it's not going to be able to regrow because we get some extra damage onto this druid and this change actually is really important and it's connected to the perma spike change so now the fourth tier spikes have the lifespan of the previous perma spike tower the fifth tier and the fifth tier perma spike spikes actually now last forever and this is exactly the reason why the top pad druids got got buffed and now do extra damage because these spikes now last forever and obviously you know you would have been able to exploit this and basically win by itself you know this setup is going to win by itself on most of the maps in bt6 so that's it for all of the new major changes in this update 42 as usual there's a lot more stuff that we're going to test on the channel when it launches so if you guys haven't subscribed yet make sure to do so thanks for watching the video and i'll see you all in the next one